ask her if she needs her pieces now, but I always thank her for her service in the kitchen. Yeah. Um, Patty is queen of the kitchen. <laughs> queen of the kitchen. What I remember most is when she was in her deepest fight with her illness mm -hmm. and there was a call for prayer. She was on it. She was first on the list and calling everybody and say, hey, we got to pray for this person. Mm -hmm. And she herself needed it, but right. she went beyond that and mm -hmm. still reached out for the needs of other people who still needed to be served. Right. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. yeah. My mom knows that I have a condition and she in a while, in a home church. Mm -hmm. God's been forefront in my life for many years, but I haven't found a home church. But sitting next to her, Mom, mm -hmm. I really feel God gave me this word for you. It's a song that just came to my mind. It's Refiner's Fire. Mm -hmm. Your heart's one desire is to be holy, yes. set apart for Him. And I, you have gone through the fire like nobody I've ever known before. And he's purifying you. And what you're about to go through again, you're going through that fire again. He's setting you apart to be holy. I love you. Yeah, I just want to say, um, Tomorrow's Patty's birthday, so don't, don't forget to bless her. <laughs> yeah, by the way, she is going to have a birthday tomorrow, and she so sends you guys all out yeah. cards and everything, but I got to thinking, who sends her the cards for her birthday? <laughs> Three quarters of a century. Amazing woman. Been through a lot. And God's not done with her yet. Amen. Anyone else? Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Excellent. Thank you. We just recognize the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ upon Patty Scarpine, your daughter, our sister. The grace that's been in her life since she was a little girl to love and serve other people. To look beyond their sins and weaknesses and see their needs just as you do, our, our needs. Lord, thank you for molding and shaping in her the heart of God and for presenting her, Lord, uh, to you and to us as a mature, godly, uh, proven uh, follower of Jesus Christ, imitator of God, servant of the church and servant of God. Lord, only you could have done this. This is not something Patty could have done or we could have done. Only you could have done this in her heart. As, as she has spent time with you, as she has waited upon you, as she has, Lord, abided in you. Lord, your life, your love, your power, your liberty, your wisdom have flowed into her, out of the vine and into the, uh, out of the branch and into the vine. Lord, we just thank you for the work of grace that you are doing and have done in Patty. And we just uh, confirm again through this act of church ordination, Patty, as a servant of God and a servant of the church, we bless her, we ordain her, ordain her, Lord, because you have ordained her. And we just set her aside as your servant in this church and for all who would Come here, Lord. We just bless her, Father, and thank you for her. And we pray that you'll give her many more years to run her race uh, full of grace and glory, full of love and joy and peace and righteousness in the Holy Spirit, Lord. And thank you, God, for this day. Thank you that you kept her alive. Thank you, Lord, that the, the days of her, of her life are many yet to come. We just bless her, Lord, and thank you for Patty Scarpin. In Jesus' name. This uh, church office is confirmed upon Patty Scarpine in recognition of the grace of God to, be, uh, to serve the people of Abundant Life Fellowship. 
and it's signed by uh, Beth and I on this date. Mm -hmm. And we've got the little footprints in the sand there. This is kind of our logo. So, Patty, congratulations. And, uh, Uh, we have a <clears throat> cake and coffee. We have a special cake out there that we've got for Patty for ordination and a little bit for her birthday too. We didn't put any birthday stuff on it, but uh, her birthday's tomorrow. She's 75, and, but it's for her ordination. We'll be able to stay for that. And next Sunday, uh, we leap forward in time. Don't forget to turn your clocks on Saturday night ahead one hour. Thank you, Jason. Thank you, Marshall, for reminding me. <laughs> All right, God bless you. Thank you for coming. Uh, there's cake and coffee out the Bye.